Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play Diablo 2. I'm your Game Master Darius. As we left off, we had explored the sewer level to get vengeance for a poor lady that had lost her husband and son. Poor lady. But in the time down there, we had actually found a, another Herodic scroll telling us, hey, uh, we gotta find a Herodic staff, Herodic staff head, and a cube. Okay. In order to... Also, why is my stamina... I feel like my stamina is bugged out. Do I have just so much stamina? I didn't realize I could squish that scorpion. Anyways, tomb number one. I presume. Of seven. Poison shrine. Let's not poke that one. Bullhelms. Oh my lord. You know, I will say, I actually do appreciate these beetles automatic lightning attack that they do. Only because it uh, allows me to look around the place and be all like, ah yes, I know what's in here. Go ahead and just pop that. Use this. Eight with a poison reduce thing. Nah. Now, I'm also going to assume that it's not going to be basically any of these random ass ones that we find that is going to have any of the plot stuff. But I do need to be on the lookout for new gear as well as for leveling up, so. I saw the Grim. Hey, she feels much stronger now. Nope. Oh, that's a lightning. Hmm. Concentrate's fine, but I really like Shout. Shout. Let it all out. These are the things I can do without. Come on. I'm axing at you, so come up. Okay. Better stop that and nip that in the bud before, you know, YouTube suddenly decides, hey. Even though you are clearly not actually seriously singing this song. It sounds close enough to the actual song. I know it does not sound close enough. YouTube's dumb. All I gotta say. Don't read tomb, level two. Oh god, these places are gonna be huge, aren't they? Oh boy. No, nope. downside. I can't see where the hell the monsters are. Yeah, take those burns. Probably just some random fallen ancestors or something. You won. Love that I found a severed head on an armored sand. Crystal sword. I am overburdened. Damn it. Expecting some loot in a goddamn place like so. Yeah. 
Alright, big ish tomb. Oh, creeping feature. Come on, you. Eh. Eh. It's any slower game, and I might go through Torpor just waiting for you. Go ahead and put some of these potions into my pockets. More mana after every kill. That's pretty good to use. I'm not sure why the hell I bother with trying to drink that. Should be able to pick up. Yeah. Arch should be one thing. Deckard, where are you? Good day. Hello. Get out of here. Good day. Hello. Uh, Paladin only. Yeah. Kind of what I figured. Wait, was this the one? Nah. And... Right. Uh, it is so tempting to get a socketed weapon just so as I could use that. It's amazing to see, though, that none of these are going to be up to snuff for a while. Amazing and a little sad. Poker chainmail. All right, chainmail is probably what I'm going to be looking at next for a long while. Anyways, more mana absorption. This thing's starting to get a little full. I'm going to need to start getting rid of shit. All right, crystal sword. Oh man, I lost that experience boof. Hello. Well, that room does not look pleasant. Can't wait to. Get nearly utterly decimated going through here. Okay. <laughs> Running out guys that we need to kill. Throwing axe. That throwing axe should be worth a pretty penny. Hello. I am overburdened. Damn right we are. Any other random schmucks monsters around here? One more healing potion for the road, eh? Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Game quite literally was just like, hey, here's a... Um, Oh, here's a couple of things that should tide you over until you uh, find some actual proper treasure like at which point I was just like okay hmm which means the switch continues I don't like these things already. Naturally. Oh. Huh. Now let's go back in and sell the few things we already picked up. 
Deckard. Good evening. Hello. Let's see, Bardiche. Throwing axes I can't use. Pretty cool sword. Not deflecting. Better chance of blocking. Nice. It's a crying shame. It's otherwise useless. <clears throat> and what the hell is up with, up with my stamina? See, what I really want is one of these battle axes to have some really good stats and to have slots. I said it's still stupid tempting to get something that has enhanced damage on it. Theoretically, I could probably look around the town and be all like, hey, anyone else need any jobs done? That'd be smart. It's clearly better just to wander out into the deserts. Clearly. Oh, wait. Hold still. Thank you. You, come down here. Oh, I think I know what happened. I'm looking at my stamina being all like, why is it still not filling completely? And I think that's because for the longest times I did have that one rune charm, whatever. Shed hatchet hands? The hell is a hatchet hand? Oh. Uh, that one charm that increased my stamina for the longest time. Maybe the game just got used to me having them. game they're allowed to give me loot come on land land please I want to point out too I can't exactly target them while in the while they're in the air either I don't think I could, say, throw a javelin or shoot them down with arrows. Tear room. Man, it's getting so many of those mana regen ones. I want to say that the game's trying to tell me something. Oh. Clippers. Maybe I should find something that gives me resistance to lightning. Axe, axe, belts. Those axes don't even have a goddamn input for a slot. Clearly, they can't be good. If I do a restore instead of a forever. No? Yeah, I want to say that that's a little glitched right now. That's fine. I'm only running everywhere. Incoming message from the big giant head. Oh, wait a second. I'm realizing that's probably a landmark. And however the hell we find the locations of the Herodric staffing cube. 
It's gonna be through that, isn't it? Calling it now. Oh, hello. Well, that's why they're called leapers. Feeling I'm going to level up before I find the next tomb. Dang it. Oh, hello. Thank you. Don't need that. Get. Oh, it's not dead yet. God damn it. Loathe when monsters play the do the play dead trick. God, this place is pretty damn huge. And um That about appears to be all of it. Vision confused. Oh, wait. Is this going to be a path to another part of the desert? Yes, it is. Hello? Oh, Y'all throw, throwing lightning at me. Sorry, not lightning. Explosives. Ow. Well, this place all already sucks. Yeah, I'll save that for another encounter with these saber cats. Come on, come down here. Just want to murder you. God damn woman. Give me a little bit of the glory, why don't you? I've expected these saber cats to be a little bit stronger, but okay. Again, for all I know, I'm super leveled up for this area. when I hear the rings. God, how am I... How have I been out here for so long? And there's just been nothing out here. Prize-wise, that was worth a damn. Nothing worth a damn at all. Come on. Fine. Hey, hey. Hey. 
God damn, saber cats are all over the place. I love getting no feedback to when it is I'm getting hit though. Fantastic. Uh, let's try down here first. Is this already going? No. Okay. Yeah, I'm not even really getting anything from them. Like, sometimes I'll drop some gold, but... Hmm... Oh, they're Saber and Spirit Cats. Okay. There is a differentiation of them. Just don't ask me what that differentiation is. I am the foggiest. Not a dead end. This goes to the far oasis. Ah, we're now fighting something called Death Beetles. Aptly named. I don't think we should be here just yet. Let's go back to the, uh, what was it called? Dry Hills? Yeah. Much more welcoming sounding place for the time being. Let's see about getting my strength up to 100. Let's see, it can do concentrate again, but I think I really want to get combat mass. Ooh, wait. Iron skin. More defense is just straight out the bat. I'm a passive ass kicker. L rune. Can I gonna sit around uh sit around and make it so as he eats sweets? No, that's actually a pretty decent rune. Plus fifteen to basically all the attacks or all the defenses. All the defense. And of course if anything I really wanna find the um if this area has one, the waypoint. Dang it. All right, you birds are annoying. Stop throwing bombs at my goddamn ally. All right, take care of it. Looks like. I swear I'm not. Oh, I could have identified one of those rings. Yeah. All right. This is place gotta be so big. Wait. Did I completely miss this ladder that what appears to be a ladder over here? Why, yes, yes, I did. Mana Shrine. I feel like I just changed, uh, transitioned into a new area based on the music alone.
Hello. I do like my stamina. Only so I can actually get from point A to point B without worrying about having to stop for a short breath. I'm not impatient, you're impatient. Why you gotta be so bomb happy? I can't carry anymore. And damn it, you would. Guess I'm time portaling first. One of these times, I feel like the town portal is going to take me somewhere that is not the town. And that I will be instantaneously terrified. Stay a while and listen. Because I'm clearly not ready for whatever the hell would be on the other side of that portal. Energy. Oh, charged bolt. Neat. Selling. Maiming is tempting, but no. I could stack like multiple runes into one weapon slash armor. That'd be cool. I am apparently about ready to uh, finish off my free space in there. Oh, you know, they put another, uh, just carried it along another sapphire for the ride. Oh, that's actually a better sapphire. Neat. I get all back out of there. Oh. Hmm. What do y'all feel? Oh, hey, another two. Owls of the Dead. Neat. What do you all feel about uh, the way that this map is presented versus most modern maps? I personally really like it, if only because I'm not uh, forced to look at something other than the actual game's screen. That's the Dry Hills. Looks like I gotta go to the Halls of the Dead next anyway, so. Like, I always, I like this particular sort of a map simply because I'm able to actually focus on the screen of the game. And not just be all like, oh man, I'm gonna look only at this one corner of my screen while the game's going on. <sighs> Hard on. I do not mean to yawn. Why do I take the long way around to get to Deckard? I don't know. Good day. Hello. Hello. Eh, sell these shitty ones. He does restock with new ones as we come and go. Ooh. That's effectively a 13 to 40. Ah, oh, but this one is still so good. Even though I can theoretically do twice the amount of damage with this axe. You know what? If we're going to... Possibly, maybe, almost, sort of, get a better weapon. Might as well see about it. You gamble. You're not a gambler. You're a guy. Oh, wait. That the same damage? No, that is more damage. Four percent life stolen per hit. Does poison. More minimum damage, more enhanced damage, poison resistance. Gee. I think he actually did me a solid. Let's see.
Yeah, okay. That that little push of damage is nice. It's gonna suck not having the ice bolt when you get attacked. Because that ice bolt can be a real game changer when suddenly everything around you slows down for a solid 30 seconds. But... Anyways, I am gonna put away my money and call an episode here because when we return, we're gonna go to those halls of the dead and possibly become dead ourselves. Thank you everyone so very much for watching. I hope you're all enjoying this series as much as I'm enjoying playing it. And as always, I hope to see you all in the next video. Take care. Cheers.